Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, today is a very exciting day because I get to share some amazing news with all of you. Guys, I passed my CHT. I passed the exam. I'm so happy. Um, I found out just a couple weeks ago, and I'm sorry, I know I haven't shared the news publicly yet. I've just been kind of waiting for this big reveal moment for this to come in the mail. Yeah, so I got my official little package. I have not opened it yet because I wanted to share this moment with all of you. Um, I have known just over a week now that I passed and it was the most intense day of my life. So we knew they had sent us, HTCC sent us an email um, about a week before the results came out letting us know, hey, we expect that you'll probably know December 11th or 12th. Um, that's when we anticipate that the results will be in. And so I kind of knew at that point that I was going to be expecting um, a letter or an email knowing that I could check my results. So the day of the 11th of December, I was super nervous. Um, I was just having a lot of anxiety that day because, you know, I mean, time wears on you. Like I walked out of the exam feeling kind of like, okay, I think I did okay. I mean, I did the best I could. Um, and then the last five weeks, I just have been really doubting myself and really feeling like maybe I didn't do that well. Maybe you know, I was just going through all these horrible scenarios in my head of like, okay, you might have to take it again. And like, yeah, it's okay. But man, how much would that really suck um, to have to go through it again? And after knowing how much I worked, uh, my mental health was really struggling this fall because of, you know, my intense focus on it. And um, I have a lot of anxiety. So that's something that I'm working on in myself. Um, but it was just like a really stressful day. And finally, um, at about 3 p.m. that day, um, I got an email saying that the exam results were posted and that we could go in to check our scores. Um, and I finish work every day at 3.30 p.m. So I was like, okay, I have to wait until at least I'm off work. I want to go to the gym. Um, so I'm going to wait until after I get home from the gym because if I get the results and it's bad news, I'm going to be a hot mess. I'm going to be crying super upset and I'm not going to want to work out and I needed to get a workout in. So I went to the gym. I could barely even work out. Like I was so nervous. My heart was racing the whole time. I was just kept looking at my phone, looking at my phone, trying to resist the temptation. So I worked out for like a really crappy workout for like 50 minutes or something. And then I went outside, I got in my car and I decided I couldn't make it home. Like I had to know that minute that I what my results were and so I logged in to the server on my phone and I read the first sentence which was congratulations you have passed this, this uh, certified hand therapy exam um, and I just burst into tears I had to read it I think three times to really believe that it was true um, and I just burst into tears and just was just so relieved that it's over. Um, so incredibly proud of myself for doing that. And I say thankful too, because, you know, it is something really truly to be grateful for, but I know that I worked for it. It has nothing to do with luck. Um, it's all, you know, being confident in myself and trying to take this exam and really committing myself to something bigger. So yeah, it was a really... I'm an all-time accomplishment of my life so far. Um, this is the biggest thing I've ever done, and I'm really, really happy to be sharing that news with you guys today. It's been a really wonderful week, um, having so many family and friends congratulate me, and just feeling like I get to really celebrate this enormous moment with so many wonderful people. So I'm sorry that I didn't get let you guys know earlier than this I just really wanted this big like reveal moment of um you know I passed and here's um here's the proof of that I passed um we're not gonna cry because we've already cried too much happy tears for this um but yeah I'm really excited for the video today so what we're gonna do today is a little uh like I guess unboxing video so I'm gonna kind of take you through what came in the mail for me yay Okay, here we go. Just gonna open this. 
I'm so excited, you guys. Have no idea. You probably know. I mean, it's pretty crazy. Okay. Ooh, okay. Ooh. Nice little folder. So organized. So exciting. So here's my letter saying that I passed. Super happy. Oh, it's the best ever. My goodness. Wow. So they gave me like a nice little um, welcome letter, like kind of inviting me to be a part of this wonderful, amazing, you know, freaking accomplishment. So awesome. Yes. Like a nice little certificate. I'm going to have to frame this. I don't know what to do with all the things that I have framed on my freaking degrees and stuff like that. I get like a little ID card. How cute is that? Well, that's just the cutest thing ever. Oh, so cute. Wow. Awesome. So awesome. Has like all these little pamphlets that I can figure out how to maintain it because lord knows I'm not taking that freaking test again it was horrible no you can do it if you're preparing to do it just know that it's very hard but you can definitely do it and it is so worth it um if I had failed this time I definitely would have taken it again and again and again as many times as it takes to pass and to get this um certification because it's really important. I truly believe that um, it's so important to our field to continue learning and pushing yourself um, and just to have that designation of being like an advanced practitioner is so so crucial. It just means that you really care about what you're doing um, and you're just striving to be the best therapist that you can possibly be for your patients. Um, so this is just kind of some information it looks like about how to maintain the certification so that you never have to take the test again, hopefully, how many hours you need to have, um, you know, like how much you need to work and everything in a year to maintain your status, all that important stuff, which I'll read through, um, like a nice little, uh, just like a little brochure, like a little pamphlet about being, you know, a certified hand therapist and what that means and like kind of the community that we're a part of. Um, oh my goodness, look at this little pin. I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but how freaking cute. I'm going to have to find a safe jacket or a backpack or something that I can just pin this to because how freaking cute is that? OMG, so cute. Aw, cool. Nice. And then just some information about ASHT as well, which I actually got an email for them earlier this week about um, joining with, uh, I think you get like a discounted membership with ASHT. So that's pretty cool as well. <gasps> so exciting. This is, I don't know if this is really a, a super interesting video or not, but you know, I just wanted to kind of share with you guys like this. <laughs> freaking major moment in my life and just this accomplishment and just what it means and kind of what to expect and hopefully some of you out there are celebrating as well and even even those of you who are maybe not celebrating um, the results feel proud of yourself because you did something really extremely difficult um, and you have unlimited opportunities keep learning keep pushing yourself don't feel discouraged because you worked really hard and you are going to get it for sure. Um, just keep trying, do your best, um, reach out to mentors, set aside a lot, a lot of hours, really commit yourself a hundred percent. Um, and you will definitely get it at some point. I'm proud of you for taking it. I'm proud of you for even thinking about taking it. For those of you who are starting to prepare mentally to, um, get ready to study for the May exam, I'm proud of you for making this decision. I mean, truly all of us are amazing. And just even thinking about setting this amazing goal for yourself is something to be proud of. So yay, yay. I'm really excited. So thank you guys so much for letting me share this 
um, experience with you and share this uh, accomplishment with you and this just absolute celebration. Um, I'm really excited for the next chapter and really excited to continue learning all the time and getting better at what I do every day. Um, something I'm truly grateful for is that I really love what I do. So yeah, thank you guys so much for letting me share this with you. Um, I hope you all have a wonderful holiday and I will be back uh, probably next weekend with a new video. So stay tuned for that and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any more forward therapy, hand therapy content. Thank you.